Katalwa village is a scenic spot located between Koggala and Ahangama in the Gaul district. Here, the Katalwa Purvarama temple is well known for its murals. The walls of this temple were painted and the work completed in about the year 1880. These murals are described as belonging in the period 1884 to 1886. The newly affluent community of Lankans who were in the low country in the island and who emerged during the British colonial era were almost engaged in a competition to make their mark after the end of the Kandian period by constructing and then decorating temples. Many samples of murals in these temples show how the Kandian style of painting was gradually influenced by foreign styles. These are classified as belonging to the low country art tradition of the Kandian era. This temple comprising two sections called inner floor or atulumale and outer floor Bitamale, are also called Garbe and Pradakshina Pate. The paintings in this temple are at present being completely restored by the Central Cultural Fund and the Department of Archaeology. This task is being carried out by a team especially trained in the preservation of ancient paintings. It is generally accepted that these paintings were done by artists Kadurgalle, Mahasitra and Kadurgalle Podisitra, descendants of the Kadurgalle family of Gaul. Upon close scrutiny, it seems that the four walls of the temple had been painted by four teams simultaneously. It could be observed that all the themes in the murals are based on Buddhist literature and Jataka stories. Signs of European influences can be observed in the paintings, the notable examples being people at a party using European cutlery, forks and spoons, in one painting, a clock in another painting, sailors wearing naval uniforms in the painting of Patachara Bikkuni embarking on a ship. In the drawings, the artist had paid much attention to detail as shown by the serial number of a gun carried by a policeman in one painting and a mosquito feeding on a hand in another. The themes are based on Jataka stories such as Vesantra Jataka, Katahari Jataka, Chulla Dhammapala Jataka and Temya Jataka. Another feature with these paintings is that they have been drawn in cartoon style which can be easily read from right to left and also left to right. Among the wall paintings, an awesome depiction of scenes from a so-called hell, which is supposedly the place where those sinful among humans are banished to. This is meant to inspire good behavior in society. The Kithul tree depicted here provides a hint of how Katalua received its name. The Katalua Purwarame is like a school demonstrating differences in Kandian and low country art such as with the use of colors, motifs and methods of application and also how religious and social influences have touched the minds of the people.